welcome back to Throwback Thursday here on HDTV Handmade. It is the new year, and if you want a fresh start with your home decor, a great way to do that is to replace the throw pillows on your couch or on your bed. Throw pillows are so easy to make, and today we're going to learn how to make them out of winter coats on this segment of Be Original. For your next sewing project, no need to go to the fabric store. All of the material you need can probably be found right there in your coat closet. Old winter coats make beautiful throw pillows. We're going to first take the lining out of our coat because we're going to be using that as the back to our pillow. And I like working with the wool coats or fur coats the best. And you're just going to cut right around the edge. When you're selecting which coats you want to turn into pillows, you also might want to keep an eye on some of the decorative details that are on the coat because you can incorporate those into your pillows. Some of them have some real pretty decorative linings. And one winter coat will set you up with quite a bit of material. And then once the lining's removed, I'm going to set that aside for now, you want to decide which part of the coat you want to turn into the front of your pillow. And I'm thinking this back portion has these nice buttons up the back split. We're going to use that. And some of your coats may have some interesting pockets that you want to incorporate into your pillow. You may want to make a collection, so you really want to get as much use out of the material that you're working with as possible. And we're going to create an 18 by 18 size pillow. So what I do is take my pillow form out of the package. We're just using a standard pillow form you can find at any fabric store. And the package that it comes in, I always use as my template. Makes a nice pattern and saves from any measuring. And I just pin it into place and cut around it. I'm working on one of the smaller size pillows here, but I do recommend going large and doing maybe one of the 24 by 24 size pillows. They look great in this wool coat material. I'm just going to cut this out. There we go. And I'm going to take that same pattern and cut out a piece of the lining. You could cut them out together. I just, the lining sometimes shifts around. So I usually do them separately. I'm going to have that nice pattern. Tells me right where the middle is. We'll just cut this out and then we're ready to sew our pieces together. And if you don't want to go out and get a pillow form, I like to sometimes just cover up pillows that I already have. Bed pillows work great. There we go. Go ahead and get this out of the way. Now we're going to go ahead and pin our lining to our wool portion. We're going to pin right sides together. Now we're just going to do a straight stitch all the way around, about a half of an inch in. You want to be sure to leave a nice opening in one of your corners. It's about five to six inches long. Move our pins, turn it right side out, and insert our pillow form. There we go. And hopefully I've left enough of an opening to squeeze my pillow form through. Get in there, make sure we fill out all the corners. Perfect fit for a pillow. And all you have left to do is turn this in. And to make it easy to sew, I pin it. And then that's going to make that very easy for you to just hand stitch that shut. And you've just turned outerwear into a beautiful throw pillow. And if you get a large enough coat, you can score yourself many, many pillows.
I think that pillow turned out so cute, and it utilizes one of my favorite craft tricks, which is to buy large size clothing from the craft store so that you get a ton of material for really cheap. However, if you think that cutting up a winter coat is wasteful, you can of course just make this out of fabric from the fabric store, or you could cut up clothing which is damaged in one part so that you wouldn't be able to donate it anyway. So thank you so much for tuning in to Throwback Thursday here on HGTV Handmade. We cannot wait to continue throwing it back every Thursday all year long.